to set a maximum and minimum height on the Massey Ferguson e-loader system, if we hit the three bars in the top right hand corner and navigate to our loader screen, you'll see that we have our lift and lowering position over here. You'll see the red bar in this bar graph. That's where the loader is currently located. It is important to note in order to set a max height and a minimum height, we have to go over to our loader selection for the raise and lower. Select that, and then in the bottom middle of the screen we have the arrows and up and down with the loader. This has to be turned on in order to enable this function. So you turn that on and hit OK. Now if we go in, I'll raise the loader up to the position, to our max height position. Say we're in a barn, we want it to not go as high as that, so that way we don't hit our ceiling. If I hit the maximum position button here, you'll see it puts in a white bar with an arrow. Now if I come down and say I want my minimum or my minimum height selection to be there, we can come in and hit the minimum on the bottom and that'll set your minimum height. So now when operating the loader it is going to operate between those two bars. You'll see as I come up it'll stop at the white line and then as I come down it will also stop at the other white line. To remove those lines from the operational sequence, all we have to do is push and hold on the selection we made. So to get rid of the lower line, if we push and hold on that button, it's going to remove the line from the screen. Same thing with the top button, if I push and hold it, it's going to remove your maximum height from the screen of the tractor. And that will be how to set minimum and maximum height on the loader in the new MFE loader system.